today we will discuss what is uniform civil code first of all we try to know what is uniform civil code the uniform civil code calls for formulation of one law for india which would be applicable to all religious communities in matters such as a marriage divorce inheritance adoption the court comes under article 44 of the constitution which lays down that the state shall endeavor to secure a uniform civil code for the citizen throughout the territory of india the issue has been the center for political narrative and debate for over a century and priority agenda for the bhartiya janata party which has been pushing for the legislation into parliament the saffron party was the first to promise that implementation of ucc if it's come to power and the issue was part of its 2019 lok sabha election manifesto तो यूनिफॉर्म सिविल कोड क्या है यूनिफॉर्म सिविल कोड यह है जो एक लॉ सभी लोगों के लिए अप्लीकेबल होगा इन सच मैटर जैसे मैरिज हुआ डिवोर्स हुआ इनहेरिटेंस हुआ एंड एडमिशन चलो और एक क्वेश्चन आता है व्हाट इज आर्टिकल 44 व्हाट इज आर्टिकल 44 इंपोर्टेंट because the court come under uh, the court comes under article 44 of the constitutions the court comes under article 44 of the constitution to so why is article 44 important the objective of article 44 of the directive principle in the indian constitution was to address the, the discrimination against vulnerable groups and harmonies डाइवर्स कल्चर ग्रुप अक्रॉस द कंट्री डॉक्टर बी आर अम्बेडकर वाइल फॉर्मुलेटिंग द कंस्टिट्यूशन ही हैड सेड द यू सी सी इज डिजायरेबल बट फॉर द मोमेंट इट शुड रिमेन वोलेंट्री एंड दस द आर्टिकल थर्टी फाइव ऑफ द ड्राफ्ट कंस्टिट्यूशन वॉज एडेड एज द पार्ट ऑफ डायरेक्टिव प्रिंसिपल ऑफ द स्टेट पॉलिसी इन पार्ट फोर ऑफ द कंस्टिट्यूशन ऑफ india as article 44 it was incorporated in that constitution as an aspect that would be fulfilled when the nation would be ready to accept it and the social acceptance to ucc could be made aaj kal ye news kafi charcha mein abhi kuch लीडर्स फेवर्स में है कुछ लीडर फेवर्स में नहीं है यूसीसी के जैसे आज अभी न्यूज आ रही है कोरस फॉर वन नेशन वन लॉ यूनिफॉर्म सिविल कोड यूसीसी गेट सपोर्ट फ्रॉम द कांग्रेस एमपी उन्होंने रीजन क्या दिया इसके बयान में तुलसी सेड दैट मुस्लिम वुमेन नीड टू बी प्रोटेक्टेड एंड देयर ह्यूमन राइट बी रिस्टोर एंड द यूसीसी विल ओनली फैसिलिटेट दिस अभी और हिमंत विश्व शर्मा का कहना यह है प्रैक्टिस विल बी क्रिमिनल एक्ट एंड सेज अंडर द यूसी प्रैक्टिस लाइक पोलिगेमी अब क्वेश्चन आता है व्हाट इज अ पोलिगेमी पोलिगेमी पहले समझ लेते हैं पोलिगेमी विल बिकम द क्रिमिनल एक्ट एंड पनिशेबल With jail term, it is this clause which has reeled up Muslim leaders. A I M I M Chief Asaduddin Owaisi, who believed that UCC will deprive them of rights, privileges as are currently prescribed under Islamic law. On the other hand, BJP ruled state have made a strong pitch for the one nation, one law, from Uttar Pradesh to Uttarakhand. to assam the chief minister of the these state have categorically spoken about the need of law and take, taken a step in this direction congress mp endorses assam uh, assam cm's statement on ucc 
Congress MP's statement comes in the backdrop of Assam CM Hemant Vishwa Sharma stating that UCC is necessary to give justice to Muslim Uwe. Sharma said, everybody wants UCC. No Muslim woman want to her husband to have three wives. Ask any Muslim woman, UCC is not my issue. It is an issue for all Muslim women if they are to be given justice after the scraping of triple talaq, UCC will have to brown. Section, what is a polygamy? Polygamy become legal in India. First of all, what is a polygamy? Polygamy become illegal in India in 1956 and uniformly for all citizens except, except for Muslim who are permitted to have four wives and four Hindus in Goa and along the western coast where bigamy is legal. So, polygamy in India, polygamy in India. Polygamy means everyone can marry uh, two wives and two husbands. If you want to, if you want to Polygamy, it means the practice or custom of having more than one wife or, or husband at the same time. It, polygamy is allowed in India for Muslims and Hindu in Goa. But in other religions are prohibited. So overall, 